Hi, it's my time to shine. I will be doing a combo read. A combo read is when people be trying to give somebody else birth date with theirs, um, a mate, a significant other, somebody they're interested in. I'm doing combo reads. Everybody know my reads is 70 75 up. I will be doing a combo read for $100 for two birth dates. This is only going to be for the next seven days. It's going to be a combo read. It will come in one video. One for you, one for them. Or if it's two males, two females for $100. If you look at and you feel interested, please go to my About Me section. You can hit my email with the name, birth date. You just to tell me that, not the story. Um, the story will come out. I'm divinely guided, so it will come out regardless of what's going on. And both names and both birth dates. Sometimes I don't use your full name, and I could make an error and you know, misspelling your name, um, or even not your day, but your birth date, just know when you divinely guided, you don't even meditate for the birth date so much. You feel what I'm saying? You meditate for the person and into it into their spirits. Because I had a lot of people, they just was like, they said something, and I'm like, it's not even your date, it's the birth, your birth year. And now it's your literally birthday, then that's a problem. But a lot of people just a little too much for me. So some people, like, I don't even want to set their money anymore. They're on a block list. They can't send me no money. They got to find another reader. That's how I am. Like, I'm not one of the readers going to put up with anything or put too much nitpicking. I just not setting no money from you, like, bottom line. So that's for a few. So peace like, and blessings to you. But I don't deal with all of that. But anyway, I'm not a psychiatrist, I'm not a therapist, I'm not a counselor, bottom line. I'm a spiritual healer, and a lot of people don't want to get healed, they want to stay in the same situation, so there's nothing I can do about that. So, yeah, I'm doing combo reads for $100 for two birthdays, so people don't be slick, oh, da, 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 nah, you can't throw that in, that's two different reads, I'm very smart. Keep forgetting that, this master, master degree ain't nothing slow about it card that come out is a four of wands it could be some type of celebration here it could be a marriage engagement a, a reunion or a or a unity like a partnership here in the past Sagittarius Aries Leo that came out bottom of the deck is somebody could be stealing from you stealing your energy stealing your time or literally stealing something from you could be Aquarius what is the energy surrounding this read yeah the queen of rods somebody can't make something happen somebody mad they can't make something happen could be engagement a marriage what is the energy yeah somebody's not closing a cycle out here because they waiting for their ships to come in not really their ships that come in they waiting to take a chance and something somebody want to make something happen but somebody not closing out a cycle the energy i'm getting is like Somebody upset about a marriage or something. I don't know. Let's see. We're going to clarify this Queen of Rods because she's mad. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. What is the energy surrounding the Queen of Rods? Yeah. The Knight of Swords. Yeah. She cut somebody off with truth and clarity in the situation. A present energy. Somebody from our past. Motions is all over. Could be a Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Somebody she knew for a while. I, I feel somebody was married and cut somebody off and somebody don't want to close this cycle and they're just thinking about what's the next step here why they cut them off i don't know we could find out hair font yeah somebody that they was married to they cut off the queen of rods cut off um it could have been because she was given and taken equally in this in this situation or could have even been a third party Let's see. Somebody don't want to close that cycle. What is the energy surrounding the world, please? What is the energy surrounding the world? Yeah, you got the King of Pentacles here, which is a Taurus, Capricorn, also Aries energy. Queen of Swords is here, too. Yeah, I said that to third party. She's mad, too. Okay. 
the hangman, somebody is coming up out of a situation that they put themselves in. Yeah, the magician, somebody got everything that makes something happen and judgment. Yeah, some court judgment. Yeah, somebody was married. And somebody was lying about being married and was having third parties here. And they're just trying to think, what can they do? What, what's the next step they could do in this? Because they know about each other. Yeah, they was having a third party. He was balancing this shit out. But he was married. Or she was married. Yep, somebody was married and playing a game. And see, like everybody, somebody cut them off. The queen, of, the queen of Wands cut them off. So I think the Queen of Wands is married to this individual here. What is the energy surrounding the three of wands? Because you got the king of pentacles here. So this person may have a lot of money. Yeah, something was built on a faulty foundation that came tumbling down with Sagittarius energy. Yeah, this the future as well. Yeah. Somebody may cut off a, a Sagittarius. Oh, wow. Yeah, Paige of Swords. Somebody was being watched. Somebody probably was watching this person mess with this other person, creep with this person. Um, this indicate trouble with the police. It looked like it was a lot of stuff going on here. This is a quick thinker. This is somebody that's watching. Somebody was watching. Somebody seen this going on. Somebody else is just focused on their money right now, but somebody or focus on working. Or this was going on doing work hours. Yeah, let me see the overall energy. Yeah, somebody not feeling comfortable right now. Capricorn towards Virgo. Yeah, that's what I see here. I see somebody was having a third party here. And it's like, somebody seek this. Somebody told. Somebody told fast, too. Night is fast. Somebody told the queen. One of these queens. Because they both mad. King of Pentacles is here as well. Yeah. He thought because he had money, he was getting away with all this. But somebody, somebody seen them doing all this. Somebody told. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, that money was coming in fast. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, they was cheating. And it got out there. People be doing too much. We want to see what's going on with that energy. Yep. That queen arrived bounce stuff. What is the energy? And like a judgment, it might be some court or um divorce proceedings. What is the energy? I took the easy way out. You could take what resonate with that. I'm going to get one more of my cards here. What's the energy? Mmm, that was a lot trying to come out. What is the energy? Well, you had two. My shine will blind you, but what really came out is the Grim Weeper. This is somebody that just come through, just do whatever, cheat, lie, narcissist. Yeah. It was a lot going on here. That's the energy I see for this reading. I'm going to end this reading. Yeah. It's never no faithfulness. Peace, light, and blessings.